I haven't really had a chance to um, film anything over the last couple of days because uh, Newcastle Film Club have been filming Nails, which is by far the most challenging um, film we've ever made, um, as you all know. So, but having said that, um, the first weekend filming at Nikki's house, thanks Nikki, by the way, your house is amazing, it was perfect, and Paul, um, we had a really good two days. We ran over a little bit on day one. Day two, we were wrapped on time. Everything went really well. Got some really nice shots. Um, so, yeah, I mean, it's been a real challenge to get to this point. But if we continue as we are um, and get through the entire shoot as we did yesterday, then we could be in for... A, a quite a special film made with, like we said, virtually, you know, comparatively at the tiniest budget. Um, when you think there's 77 cast and crew in total on this. Um, so, you know, it's exciting times. But, I mean, the flip side is I've had to be up at five in the morning, prepping all the paperwork, pick, pick, picking people up, getting through the shoot, it taking on various different capacities. So um, I'm a de facto executive producer, uh, operating boom, making cups of coffee, uh, just and anything that people need, you know, um, designating safe areas, moving gear, uh, then getting back late, eat, sleep, get back up at five, do all the same again. Uh, and now it's Monday, time to get prepared for uh uni like um, what have we got today our oh, script writing and then in the studio with lee and johnny y so it's busy it's busy uh oh and today after that i've um got tickets for sunderland shorts film festival so i have to pick my friend danny up then we'll go and watch where the magpies fly for um, the first, well, no, it's not the first festival that it's been at. It's been very successful at festivals. Laurel leaves all over it, uh, which is great. And um, but it's it's the first local one, I think. Um, yeah, so we'll be going to watch that at Sunderland Shorts. Uh, that'll be nice. And uh, but it takes its time as well. And I've already got um, some homework that I'm going to be fall behind with uh shooting um is it like between four and six shots telling a story with no characters and uh, i have an idea for it it's just a matter of finding the time to book a camera out film it and edit it in at a standard that i'm happy with and uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that necessarily because I've also got to prep for in the frame, which again, I've just not had enough time for. Uh, so it's a lot. There's a lot going on. And uh, I still haven't met up with uh, where we want to hold Listen Up right now as part of the open mic uh, thing for the Ferry Hill Creative Writing Group. So there's a lot of projects that... I'm kind of just trying to dip in, do as much as I can and move on um, to the next one. It, it's just juggling and spinning plates. So it's not easy. Um, but you all know this because I've said it a thousand times already. Um, but it's still, it's all positive stuff. So we'll see what, you know, well, I kind of know what today brings. And then we'll ease, us, ease into the film festival kind of side of things. Um, but the downside is I, I'm just hardly at home and uh, I'm not really being able to give the full attention to everything that I need to. Uh, on the upside, I did upgrade the uh, memory and storage space on my laptop. So that's now 64 gig of memory and uh, that should help me edit my films much faster and more efficiently. So that's a positive. And uh, yeah, I think that's it for now. And um, again, just busy times. Next weekend, it'll be back to um, Nails. 
and that's the warehouse scenes and the bar scene and then the final uh, 28th and 29th is the final weekend and that's all the fight scenes in the warehouse and then that's principal photography wrapped so yeah we'll get through October and then we will have achieved a lot of cool stuff but I'll be ready for a rest by then or at least to just take my foot off the gas a little bit and just take a few moments I'll need that and uh, January they'll, there's no in the frame so I can use that as a little bit of a rest time because um, I know I need to be careful of taking well I have taken too much on it's just battling through and then calming it down uh, we've also got the mam anthology to get through as well uh, which is a great project but again it's it's all time and and resources um well good good stuff so i shall speak soon